Hi everyone, I hope you are. This is Coins Kid. Just going to dive into Holo Chain right now. Hot tickers, hot USDT. Um, just taking a look at the chart right now. You can see we've hit a hit a hit a head on on the zero three eight two there, and we we got rejected, and we're coming back down. We fell back through the EMA here, okay, on the four hourly time frame. It's a four hourly time frame, okay. We fell back down, and we're starting to come back down. And you can see that this particular pattern that we broke out of this sort of falling wedge type pattern that we found ourselves in, it's, it's starting to tighten. Do you see that? That we've fallen out of it, and we've what well, we broke out of it. So we broke out and we started to march on, hit our head on the 0382, fell back and we've actually lost the EMAs at the moment. Okay, so we're having a bit of a correction. But you can see that this particular trend line now, when when it was acting as resistance on the way up, do you see that? Hit in your head, hit in your head, hit in your head. You broke out and you're falling back on it as support. Look at how many times you fell on it as support now. Do you see that? Support, support, support. And right now you've fallen on it again. It looks bad. But the fact that you're holding this particular trend line now as support instead of falling through and that in your head as resistance is confluence to the fact that you you know you, you are starting to form this reversal right now and it's it's all good i just want to reassure you if if you do see hot breaking this low okay this particular low if it does start to fall lower than that and close below that particular level there which is zero one six two one nine seven on the Frawley time frame there then you are looking at that reversal pattern of this you know uh basically reversal of the reversal so to speak so this at a minute what we've got going on is this reversal pattern where we broke out from the bottom we've made this sort of v-shaped bottom right here and we started to march on but what, what you may start to perform here okay because it's all patterns in patterns okay and i'm still bullish the truth is i'm bullish but these little rollbacks are perfectly normal and you, you can form into this uh uh, support line now is support you see this is this falling wedge and effectively if you do start to zoom out on the daily time frame it begins to look like a ball pennant uh, a ball flag sorry so what i'm saying is hold this support do not lose this low okay lose this low and it gets worse you can see a further correction i'll zoom out in a minute and show you what i mean but right now we're holding support and it looks good because potentially what you might have on the cards here is this pattern here right and this is a basically a uh, inverse head and shoulders pattern do you see that so if this comes up right now what i'm going to do is change the color of that so yeah because you, you can sort of see once once sort of things sort themselves out you, you've basically got a bit of a pattern here okay so you've got this support line there a resistance line do you see that so you've actually gone up and made a resistance line off this bottom because that's what happens you go up and you hit a level of resistance you start to come back down and you start to form new patterns so you've got a level of resistance just there on hot right so you've made a low made this low sorry made that low come up hit a level of resistance made a lower low come up hit a resistance and you're now coming down it looks bad but if you don't make a low lower than this one you're actually forming a very, 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 very good pattern indeed. And I'll show you that pattern right now. And so what I'm saying is if this can start to come back up now and sort of retest this resistance line, okay, and get through it, you're looking at inverse head and shoulders. You see this inverse head and shoulders. That is a very, very good pattern because the breakout from that, if you break that level of resistance, which currently sits at, and I'll just mark that in for you, okay. It currently sits at this sort of level here, this zero just there zero zero two oh two five nine eight okay if it comes back up and hits that and breaks it you're looking at a beautiful trade right there for, for hot of around that level and that will take you up to the golden ratio okay now what does say to you about the golden ratio if you can get through the golden ratio on a retracement you're golden it's a, it's a golden ticket it's a, it's a rocket it's a ticket to mars okay on the rocket ship so effectively you know you could be looking at a really nice trade if it breaks out of around uh 20 percent for hot so right now what you need to see is it hold this level of resistance uh hold this re previous resistance of this sort of falling wedge type pattern that it found itself in on a downtrend you need to see it hold its support and so far it's holding its support it's really good it's really strong get that bounce get back above these emas retest this resistance line okay of this new pattern of this inverse head and shoulders that we've got going on for hot holo okay get through that you're looking golden for a retracement now to that golden ratio and obviously get through that and you, you, you're looking at a full march on to the previous uh, high there which is the all-time high so effectively you know from here if you was confident see that bounce i'm not telling you what to do but that could be a really nice trade up there of around 75 percent for hot so do keep an eye on that like i said to you you can't afford to make a lower low there you start coming down and losing this uh, support as a lower low and, and you start doing something like this okay you come down and then 
and you make a lower low and bounce up then you, you're still in a downtrend okay this reversal that we've got going on is is obsolete and we've got to sort of reset reset ourselves and zoom out even more because at the minute if we zoom out on a daily time frame okay and this is what i say to you always zoom out always zoom out oh it's really messy isn't it i'm gonna have to tie it up one second let me just tie this up so again if in doubt zoom out okay and you can see that you're effectively forming a bull bull flag on the on the grand scheme of things you're just coming back on yourself and that is a, a reversal pattern just like it was here where you fall down you, you're forming a kind of bull flag type pattern here okay where you you actually get down and all of a sudden you, you just have the breakout and boom you have the breakout and you, your breakout target is from your, your top to your previous level of consolidation which was roughly that sort of area the previous swing high and you break out and look where you go to so it's all good it's all golden for continuation okay no reason to panic the only reason i said to you the, the only reason to start looking at charts and, and start panicking is if you start losing the daily okay they start losing the daily emas and especially the red line which is a 55 ema if you start losing that you're dragging it over your shoulder you're creating a bearish cross okay you're creating a bearish cross and you're looking you're looking for a, a bear market and it's looking for a downtrend and you, you sort of get caught under the emas and you can't get back above it and it contributes to the downtrend at the minute you're golden you've got support you're golden to sort of come down retest support and march on for hot it looks good it looks good and that that price prediction that we outlined the other day uh, looks golden basically so i just wanted a quick quick video there just to reassure you that, that everything's okay and, and marching forward and onwards but again obviously target that um lower low there you can't afford to make a lower low than that because you'll be invalidating this reversal pattern and, and obviously falling back into this sort of falling wedge that you've actually broke out of on, on the four hourly time frame there okay so it's all good it's all good um just testing lower levels of support again this is crypto it's very volatile so yeah that's basically it. i'll give you a little update there and hopefully hopefully you can take something from that and, and move forward but again just target that this sort of joy joy trend lines in okay draw your top resistance line in there resistance 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 do you see that i mean i could do that you do this look you're not getting no touches do you see that so you was in a caught in a downtrend okay caught in a downtrend you form this bottom you're now sort of forming this inverse head and shoulders it providing this can now get the bounce there go up and break that resistance it's all golden it's all golden take care everyone i'll be back soon with another update on hot and uh, have a good day and once again thank you for your continued support and everything you do in the channel there um to, to contribute towards the growth of coins kid catch you soon bye bye